This is the Vauxhall Ampera. It's an electric car with a range extending engine. It's just won the What Car Green Car of the Year Award for 2011. You'll be able to buy it next year. Uh, they'll have about 3,500 they plan to sell here in the UK. And I'm here with Ian Allen, who is responsible for the launch of the Ampera, to ask him a few questions about it. It's one of the early shows where you've actually had the Ampera on display to the general public. What has been the, uh, the reaction to it? Well, the reaction has been incredible in many ways. Um, it's great that we've got a show like this so that we can actually bring the Ampera to the, to the public. The most frustrating part for us is actually getting people in the car to drive the car. And again, the great thing is, is when they come out of the car, having driven the car, it raises a lot more questions in their mind, but they actually understand a lot better the proposition because we can say to them as much as we want to, you know, it's not just a pure battery electric vehicle or it's not just a conventional hybrid. You can drive it on a daily basis with up to 50 miles charge, but actually there's no range limitations. And to many people, that's a little bit hard for them to get their head around. So actually get them behind the wheel of the car, experience how the car drives and get them out is, is brilliant for us. I have a lot of people who've never driven an electric car before. The uh, expectations of an electric car, you know, they, they're, they're fairly low. They think of milk floats, they think of things like the G-Wiz, and you know, not proper cars, if you like. So what's been people's reaction after they've driven the car and uh, you know, come out the other end? Well, when people get out of the car, actually one of the most common reactions is that they say it's a car drives like a car you know once we're driving it it actually is just like driving a normal car of course in terms of the the response of the the torque the the instantaneous delivery to the wheels are, are in 370 newton meters of torque is brilliant and the 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 appearance of the car is fantastic but you know once they drive the car it's a solid feel car they like the comfort about it they like the fact that you know, it just drives like a normal car, albeit an electric one and silent. And in, and in terms of the numbers of people, we, one of the frustrating things again for us is getting enough product in the country to actually do it because we don't start producing the right hand drive version of Ampere until next February. But we've got six Amperas in the country, which is the most we've ever had here. One on the stand, um, one on the Watt car stand, because it won the, the green car of the year um, for Watt car on Wednesday evening. Very opportune moment for, for us to get that award. But we've also got three cars here on, on test drive. And it, to be honest, if we had more, then we could put more people through. We had 100 test drives yesterday. We'll do the same amount today. So again, it's just great to get that number of people behind the, the wheel of the car. So what's your expectations uh, uh, from Vauxhall in, in terms of how many right-hand drive cars will be sold in the UK next year? Uh, well, we, we will be uh, getting around about 3,500 units in the UK next year to register. And we anticipate that if we, if we had more and we could get more, we'd sell more. Fabulous. Thanks very much.